Come on! so much for uh, your support and uh, thank you very much for love and appreciation for my, uh, my kick from my membership last night at the SCG. Um, you'll see right now that was, as you can tell, it was a good kick <laughs> over, over the gutters. Uh, can't thank the wrists enough for allowing me. It was a pretty, pretty awesome experience there. Uh, if you haven't seen that book yet, just go out and check it out. Link will be down below. Still under it, not the SCG, honestly. Alright, <clears throat> let's head to where we're going. Oh, what's doing, lads? What's doing? The Orange Peelers headquarters. <laughs> yeah, you sound really healthy. <laughs> let's talk. All right, podcast done. How was that, Winston? Oh, nah, jokes. <laughs> it almost crashed. <laughs> nah, that was good, man. That was actually that one, was of good. Thanks for having me on. one of our better podcasts. Yeah, definitely. And Zane in the back guests. there. How was that? Yeah, it was good. It was good. Very smooth podcast. It was more yeah, it was it. definitely. It was so. Made you barking about the roost. <laughs> oh, yeah, that was fun. So uh, make sure you check out Orange Pillars on Winston Neville's YouTube channel on yeah. Thursday. Is that yeah, right? Yeah, it'll drop Thursday 9 a.m. Yes, hopefully. definitely. But yeah, c cannot wait to watch that. <laughs> Yeah, all right. Sweet. Thanks for having me on, boys. Thanks no, for thanks for thanks, for, on, thanks for the tour of Wollongong today too as well. Gong goes off. You want yeah. to go see the beach or what? No, we don't have time. <laughs> we're, gonna, we're gonna go back. To, we're gonna go to the Parramatta now. So, <laughs> so we're off the yeah, Parramatta we go. Traveler, aren't you? <laughs> yeah, I am a traveller. Brisbane to Sydney to the Gong. To Love Parra. It. To Parra. So to check it out on Thursday. Also follow. Don't follow Zane. He's a South Florida. <laughs> follow. Winston as well. He's a uh, bulldog vlog. I'll be in it tomorrow as well. So yeah, that's true. That's yeah. shot. That's all. Let's grab. Aiden, I made it. You did make it. I made three it. Three times. Oh, three hours it took me, man. The orange peel is to do. Yeah, that yeah, was good. Can't wait. Thursday. All right, but we are here. Let's talk some footy now. Eels up against the Titans here at Combank. Yep. First time I've been to a para home game since. The Premier game, when we them, yes, them, yeah, it yeah. was. Yeah. We've seen to put on big scores when we do. So. Yeah, yeah. And then I also went to Eels Titans in round one last year when it was a high scoring game as well. Yeah, that was a very controversial game. Yeah, Titans, yeah. Fans, especially there, a uh, very high scoring one. We, I don't think we scored a try in the second half. I think we scored points, but um, yeah, and obviously the Titans, you know, they've been scoring points uh, in the first half all season. They've been playing some good footy. They're getting really desperate. But, you know, our players back. I think we're going to look like a much better team than last week. Yeah, definitely. I don't think you should, I don't think you should be worried about last week at all. But, like, big game, Titans, they're rounded out behind you guys, on two points behind you guys. You have fallen out of the age of Cooper, the, the uh, Cowboys went in the round of those five, but you go back up there if you want to know. So, how important is this one? Yeah, I think it's a very important one. You know, I think from here on out, the Parramatta will play finals. Uh, most game, if not every game, is a most must win. I think the boys want a bit of revenge, you know. I've beaten at Magic Round. I think they've played better footy than the Titans, but the Titans, you know, the scoreboard showed they got the job done. Um, got to shut down Kieran for him. I can't believe I'm saying it, but he's in supreme form at the moment. Yeah. Um, he'll probably score a try today, in my opinion, at any time. Uh, but I think we can get it done. I think we can get it done for him plus. I'm going to go Kirk Patterson, first try scorer. And I remember we 30 points to 14. I reckon that will score it too. It's coming off a fantastic origin. Game three, so yeah, it didn't do a foot wrong in those three minutes. But I'm going very, yeah, definitely. I'm doing a very, very high score. I'm going 36 32 to the Oh, that's a very high score. Yeah, there will be no defense of whatsoever. That's tough on us. Yeah, but uh, good to see you, Hayden, and uh, let's get it go to, go to Hills.
All right, Titans, first opportunity. Here they go. Numbers, Jaden Campbell. I think it, I think it, I think it's okay. No. No, Bunker. He did well to stay in that too. Oh, I can't see the line. Yeah. Numbers, they're going to score there. They're going to score. Yeah, they do. Yeah. Good post try celebration for him. So, boy, he does not miss. He misses one. He has been in great goalkeeping. Sure. Effort here. That's a promotion. Oh, that is a double win. That is a double win. Come on! That is a double win. Oh, Back on 
level playing field on the players and now we might be level on the scoreboard and we are. <laughs> This reminds me of last night. It's me. What a terrible first half in the referee. I hope they feed the referee coming off. Let's see if you can play the second half, Jordan! Big second half ahead. Where's Boyd? Where's Campbell? Where are they? 
Where are they? The feeder. You know, it's it's gritty. Um, you know, we had well, you had two players Simbin, one potentially almost sent off. A lot of people saying you should have been um, heard about that, yeah. sent off in, in I, I don't know three weeks a game well, in relation really, to really that. Um, but you know, the Titans scored a lot of tries when they had eleven men on the field, as we said. But they still they're a team that you know easily can score twenty points, and uh, we we got the win. But it was tough, and you know, I don't know if I take much positive out of this one. This one's a tough one. Uh, one of the most entertaining games of the year for mine, without a doubt. But as far as win-wise goes, we let the Titans just back and forth. To I, I just expected a better performance. It should have been so much better today. Man, I really, we yeah, out. yeah. I, look, we've got the Cowboys in Townsville. We've got the Storm in Melbourne, and Penrith in Penrith coming up. We don't we need to be a games. lot better than that. A lot better. We left that game way too close to the imagination, bro. Exactly. One more snip and the Tigers get over the line, which is just... You know, you know the big thing is they didn't even have AJ Brimson. You know? As soon as I saw AJ Brimson out, I thought, you know, 13 plucks, it's looking easy. You know, it was a close game when we played in the last couple of years, but predominantly we've had a good record against this side. Exactly. I expected a better win. I'll take the two points. It's a crucial two points to keep us in the eight. We need to be a lot better against those Cowboys next week. Exactly, yeah. bro. We yeah. need to be, we need to be ready for the Cowboys, bro. They're on form right now, like yeah, none of them. Yeah, but are you guys like happy that you know, you know, when you guys had twelve nil, there's two six down to eleven players. You showed a lot of fight in that ten minutes where you had two players in the bin. Oh, you know, you could have let the game yeah. got away from you. It could have been easily like a twenty. The 12 or 24 12 at that stage. I'm happy for the most part, and I think there are some individual players that played well, but I don't think the team performance compared to what I saw in recent weeks is there. They were going down the middle too easy. Something I said about the Warriors game having middles back. You know, you had Makatoa drop, you had Ogden drop to try and fix that. And some of those issues that we saw last week, we saw tonight here at Combank Stadium. Yeah, they so were improved. For me, for the long time in a while, this is a win where I'm not taking too much confidence out of it. Yeah, it's it's a win, and you call a win a win, but you're right. Like there's just there was a lot of issues clearly spotted in this game from, yeah. from the players, from the way we did it, did things. Like it could have been a completely different game if Tanner Boyd kicked that field goal. Exactly. We, we charged that down, and I'm proud of that effort, and that's why probably Gutherson's probably my man of the match. You know, dropped the ball off the on the full, I guess. Mm. Yeah. Scored an amazing yep. try, uh, amazing try saver, and that play as well. So that, that's why he's probably my man of the match. Gutho was brilliant today. He's got to be my man of the match too. Yeah. Well, at the end of the day, you're winning. I'm not. So you take it. So. <laughs> Enjoy 14, bro. Yeah, shut up. <laughs> we'll see you, I'll see you in round 24. Looking forward to it. Go yeah, over it. Let's go. Okay, that one. Go, all right, boys, good. thanks so much for your time. And uh, make sure you go subscribe to them as well. And uh, we'll see you guys later. Thanks, thanks for coming on. All right.